I'm not like a, a tagger that goes around the face in other people's property. I'm an artist. John O'Moore's weapon of choice is a spray can, and he's using it to fight for the world's rarest dolphins, the Hector and Maui. It's a crucial time for them right now, um, and they need to be in the public eye. Hector dolphins number at only 7,000. Their North Island cousins, the Maui, are critically endangered. There are just over a hundred of them left. And according to a government report, as many as 150 Hector and Maui dolphins die in commercial nets every year. So Jono has been wasting no time stenciling his dolphins around the country. From Banks Peninsula to the banks near Parliament. What you're doing is illegal. You're defacing other people's property. I'm, I'm not like a, a tagger that goes around defacing other people's property. I've, I think about where I do my work and I try to have it so that it actually enhances the, the wall. But more than anything, he hopes it enhances the dolphins' cause. A government announcement on new strategies for their protection is expected any day. Parliament's been petitioned heavily by both conservationists and an unhappy fisheries industry. Yeah, it is, it is a few people's livelihoods, um, but this is a species of dolphin we're talking about. And if we let a species of dolphin go extinct, what hope is there for the rest of the ocean? But why do you have to break the law to get your point across? Graffiti is a good way of getting a message out there to the public, conveying a message. It's unfortunate that it has a lot of bad reputation from, from thoughtless tagging, taggers. Um, but yeah, the public has taken notice and the feedback that I've received from my work is all being worth it. But not everyone agrees. And two weeks ago, Jono got caught. A car happened to come past and it was the police. He was arrested for willful damage and sent to appear in court. So what happened? Oh, I got a diversion. So I've just got to meet up with the cops at a later stage to uh, work out my punishment. Jono had hoped to keep his identity hidden, but his arrest has changed all that. Why not just join an animal rights group or protest at Parliament? Yeah, there are other ways of going about um, protecting a species or advocating for a species. Um, I'm an artist, I work in conservation, and to me, putting the two together is, is my way of going about it. In the meantime, Jono's work is also for sale on canvas at a Dunedin gallery. Any money he makes from their sale will go to the New Zealand Whale and Dolphin Trust. It's our responsibility for, for their survival. Um, if we don't step up to the line and do what we need to do, they will go extinct and that will be a huge loss not only for New Zealand but the world. Whatever you think of his graffiti, no one wants a future where the only place Hector's play is on a concrete wall. We are